good day guys uh, today we'll be trying to review no not trying but uh, we'll try flying the JJRCX stock without calibrating the compass and the gyro okay so let's turn it on Okay, after the tone, turn on the remote. Okay. Okay. Let's wait for the green light. Takes, uh, it takes a while initializing okay we have a green light now let's uh, turn on the Wi-Fi and let's see if uh, Connect to the controller. Okay, the controller now is uh, appeared. Let's connect to it. Okay, we're connected. Now, let's uh, let's connect to the. C fly up. Okay. So right in here. Check. Okay. Let's wait for the connection to establish. Okay, start flying. That means uh, we're connected. Okay. So uh, okay, so we have the live feed. Oh man! So now we will arm the motors. It's, it's difficult to <coughs> operate with one hand. So down and out. Okay. It's armed. Now let's push the. Oops. Let's push the auto takeoff. Okay. Let's do it again. It's armed. Let's push this button. Oh. Okay. No calibration or whatsoever. Take it up. Mm. Okay. Seems stable. Just a little wind breeze. We got to take it up more. Okay. Okay, what we have here? We have a uh, Okay, we have a 12 satellites, 100% battery, and it says here, safe, safe to fly. And then, come on. Safe flight GPS, that's what it says. And the distance is 2.4, and the height is 8.6. Okay, so there it is. I'll move it forward. Okay, wait. Okay, I move it uh, a little bit forward. The distance is uh, 13, 14 meters. 
and the height is 8.5 so I guess it's not not bad without calibrating the the compass and the gyro but I don't recommend it because uh, I'm not sure what will happen to your X12 maybe they're not the same so but uh, this uh, this purpose is uh, for testing only as you can see it's stable without calibration so I guess it's uh, okay and uh, the camera the gimbal is okay on the feed here on my my phone so uh, let's try the orbit mode if it will function properly let's see okay I'll just put it down oh that's a breeze wind okay position and orbit okay the drone is uh, turning so let's see it okay wrong sticks sorry okay let's put it let's set the height and back Okay, let's see if it's orbiting. I'm not holding the remote. Oh, it's turning. Let's see on the live feed. Yeah, it's orbiting. Without the calibration, it's doing its job well. Amazing. Okay, I'll put it out on the orbit the position. Okay, so it's doing well. See, as, as you can see on the live feed. So, right in here, I'm sorry for the, the camera. Okay. Oops. Oh man. Anyway, everything's normal. The 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 distance, the height, it's normal, and we have 16 satellites, 80% battery. So be aware, be aware of the that uh, battery level. The app here is not that precise, so when it goes to 50%, don't fly farther from your takeoff point. So that's it. This is a JJRC X12. By the way, let's try return to home. Let's take it far. Let's bring it far. Okay. Oops. Let's. Uh, let's. Okay. Let's fly it farther. Okay. Let's see the. Oh, I can't see it anymore. Oops. Okay, let's push the return to home. Okay, it's returning. I don't know where will it return because we haven't calibrated the compass and the gyro. Okay, it's above us. It's right above us. Okay, 
Coming in hot. Coming in hot. Coming in hot. Okay. 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 Our takeoff point is around here. And there it is, about a meter. Uh, yeah, meter, about a meter. Okay, so this concludes my uh, review of the GRC X12 Aurora. Pretty, pretty good flyer. No compass calibration and gyro calibration. And that's the result. Okay, see you guys in our next video. Hit like and subscribe. Thank you.